Hi and welcome. So in this lecture uh, we'll get into fun tricks and and one thing you can do with Python is start a, a web server. So specify minus m and type simple HTTP server and you'll see that it's uh, started the web server at port 8000 so maybe you're not familiar with web programming or anything so you can open your browser and go to that URL so local address 8000 so 000 in this case means uh, localhost so this will work as well or at least it should work um, and you'll see files that uh, we got in this program so we got this program we wrote earlier uh, we got the image it's just a little bit too large to uh, to see but yeah we got the image and it you have all these files uh, that you can access as a web server so you can access uh, all files in the directory uh, from any computer in your network then the, the next trick it's uh, it's kind of silly so if we start the python uh, shell we can type import this and it starts some kind of poet um, which uh, is about python and there's another thing you can do is import anti-gravity which opens a opens a webcomic xqcd it's a kind of a silly tricks that don't have a special function, but uh, that, that might be uh, useful. So we can actually do some more serious things also, some more, more fun tricks in that regard. Um, so if we have a list, we can reverse that list and it will be reversed. It's in reverse order here. We specified one, two, three, four, five, and it's printing in the uh, reverse order. Uh, if you have a string, you can also reverse that way. So, hello world. And the string is printed in reverse order. And then there's an, another trick that uh, might be quite interesting. Um, if you have uh, two variables and you want to swap to change the position of these two variables, normally you would need a third variable. But in Python you don't actually need that. So if you have two variables, say uh, a is, or let's say x equals 7, y equals 10, and you want that x equals 10 and y equals 7, you can simply flip them. So Now we would have them in reverse order. Uh, hold on, there's no Z. And we just flip two variables. And so the actual content changes using this line. And we don't need to specify a third variable. 